narcissism is you know it has self-centeredness associated with it but but nar the core of narcissism is pain and emptiness uh, and longing for the end of longing is the way some people describe it and so what narcissists are doing is trying to get from the world what they need in order to feel okay to feel built up uh, self preoccupation you know that has a lot of different antecedents associated with it not not the least of which is pain when people if you're uncomfortable it's hard not to be self preoccupied so almost by definition every addict is going to be self preoccupied right cuz they're all in pain of one sort or another and so self preoccupation and self focus and all this stuff that's a symptom of the condition whether or not they also have narcissism you know the old cluster b personality constructs narcissism borderline sociopathy all my patients fit those, those criteria when they came to treatment. I don't know how much of that was there before they became a drug addict. It's hard to tell. Certainly a lot of them are trauma survivors, so they're at risk for that kind of thing. But it is definitely the time when you see treatment of addiction and recovery, a, a full recovery process, that's when you see those personality characteristics markedly change. It's the only time when if somebody comes in and they look like a borderline, I'll just say, I don't know. I know they'll get better. I know they'll get better. There's some genetic piece to it, but it, it's around it's surrounding certain. Th there's a couple theories about where it comes from, but it's ultimately adverse childhood experience, right? Uh, and fun at its fu one of its fundamental core th phenomena is a lack of connection between what we call primary affect states, spontaneous emotional states, and what you might call second order understand or second order. Exp um, uh, constructs about you know th that literally one of the things that happens narcissists they didn't get enough space to develop and connect to their real self let's put it that way it's it's, it's complicated so do you and that's one that, theory there's lots of theories do you find that more prevalent amongst uh celebrities or child schools? oh yeah well that's what my that's what we we knew it was going to be a positive result that's why we did that research protocol i i we gave everyone that came on my radio show for years a narcissistic personality inventory and then we did it all confidentially and then we collated all the data lo and behold lots more narcissism in uh, celebrities and then we published that data.